No, wait, wait, it's more than that, isn't it? It's 31 plus 21. 52. 52 years old. Shara. Hey, Logic. Busy day at work. Can't chat, but I'm here looking. Shara Dusky, I appreciate you, man. I appreciate you a lot. And I appreciate your look. I just, I just appreciate you, man. Thanks for dropping by. I'm going to shout out a few people here, starting with you. For anyone that likes to watch people play video games on Twitch, go watch Sharadetsky. Pikmin 3 Deluxe. Interesting. It's been a while since I saw uh, someone play Pikmin. I think the last person was um, Seamus. Um, S-S-O-H-P-K-C. From the, uh, the Creatures bunch. Who else? Uh, let's shout out... Uh, Hmm, Magus. Oops. Yeah. Chrono Magus recently came back from a uh, trip to Turkey. He's now rested and uh, getting ready to get back into streaming again. So, not quite sure exactly what retro game he streamed, but I think it was a JRPG. Might have been the same one that I saw a month ago. That would make sense with the timelines and everything. Also, uh, let me see if I'm going to spill this right. No, I'm not. I'm not going to spill this right. Am I? There we go. Mr. Magoo. Like, I, I, feel like, I feel like Mr. Magoo has streamed, and I'm just not aware of it. Mr. Magoo is very technically minded. And uh, from, from what I saw, like, a couple months ago, um, he makes some amazing shit. It's just that um, it's not out in the public. Like, he really does make some amazing special effects. And he's working on, like, a secret project. It's always piqued my interest what that will eventually be. But, uh, yeah. Anyway, those are some shout-outs for people. Everyone that I shout out, they are a follower, and I'm a follower of those channels. I appreciate them, they've given me advice in the past, um, and I just like watching their content when I can, so, yeah. Um, and I gave Dakos a shout-out before, so I'm not even sure that Dakos is here, but, uh, yeah, Dakos streams, he does, uh, Minecraft lately, but he does a lot of other, uh, retro titles, like, uh, Pokemon and Golden Sun Lost Age, which I did back in the day. I want a Pikachu, it's so cute! I asked my daddy to catch me one. Yeah, a Pikachu soon, I promise. Yeah, well, you're not having my rat. My rat is Uzudu. You can't touch. Uh, can I get back here? No, I can't. Alright, um... I don't want to leave through there yet. Cool. Nidoran. Bow bow. Okay. Nidoran. Shit. He is shit. Shit Pokemon. Our Pokemon's an outsider, so it's hard to handle. An outsider is a Pokemon that you get in the trade. Ah. It grows fast, but it may ignore an unskilled trainer in battle. If only we had some badges. Indeed. I think uh, there are four. Four Pokemon that can be traded from red. Um, what are they? Golem. And four, and four others. I don't know. Right. Is it time to fuck up Brock here? I think we definitely want to get our um, Pikachu a bit more leveled up. It's rumored that Clefairies came from the moon. They appeared after Moonstone fell on our moon. Mm. Rock solid Pokemon training. Indeed. Alright, alright. So let's let's go back to that. Uh, uh, do I need to go to the forest? Yeah, let's try and get a Weedle. Just to say that we've caught one. 
Oh wait, what about this area here? What's in here? Alright. Body this rat. Rat on rat violence. I love it. Get destroyed. Rats. Par paralyzed? Paralyzed? No. Set me up. Yep, this one's gonna hurt. Ooh. I think Pikachu's next attack is like a, uh, a quick attack, which is okay, it's just not, you know, amazing. these vermin. I love it. Let's get some more powerful enemies in. Just tank some damage. Hope the, par uh, the par paralysis side effect works a couple times. Or we can just, like, stomp on the level 3 rats, it's fine. Twenty-four, such a measly amount of points, but it's gonna be hard leveling up Pikachu to a high level at this point in the game. Love it when you use that tower. Rat on rat violence. Genius move to allow kids to name their captured animals nicknames. Genius move. Yeah, whoever thought of this, like, this concept of a game? Genius. Hey, Pidgey does not like Pikachu. <laughs> God damn. Excuse me. 
for those that are wondering, I'm playing on the Visual Boy Advance dash M emulator. Ooh. Oof. 2.1.4 Ooh, can we get another super effective? Get destroyed, Pidgey. Get down the ground. Oh. It's free XP. I love it. We're approaching the four hour mark, finally. We'll keep going for ten more minutes, and then we'll cut the stream. Should have never gave these rats electricity. Don't think it be like it is, but it do. The battle music for the first Pokemon game, iconic. As is the the victory um victory tune. Iconic. And great tunes. Not... Not super annoying as well. There is some battle music. Because with a lot of these, you know... This is... I would I wouldn't call this like a, a traditional JRPG. But it is, a, it is a Japanese RPG in a sense. Um, and... Usually in JRPGs you've got to grind. And the battle music... Um, is a big determining factor as to whether or not you'll want to kill people or if you can just you can handle the grind. And I feel that with Pokemon Blue, their battle music, it's it's quite tolerable. All right, we get anything new? Yeah, we'll take on Brock. I'm unsure if we're, um... We're at the level we need to be. But I feel like we've got a perfect combination of, um... Pokemon to handle Brock. Because we've got our Squirtle. And we've got our, uh, Pikachu. Get that badgie. Time to get that badgie. Oh, I. Do I go in here yet? Yeah, I did. City, Pokemon Gym Leader Brock, Winning Trainers, Abolition. Uh, I, uh, I can tell you, I can tell you have what it takes to become a Pokemon champ. I'm no trainer, but I can tell you how to win. Let me take you to the top. So, in the real world, you'd probably say no, because it's like, well... If I, if I want to be a successful streamer, let's just say, do I want to hear from someone that doesn't stream? But like, oh, I know I know how to do it. It's like... Like, you might have some good info, but like... No. I won't be taking advice from people that have, like, lived it. Whatever. Okay, let's get it happening. The first Pokémon out in the match is at the top of the Pokémon list. By changing the order of Pokemon matches could be made easier. Yeah, okay. So... Yeah, I'm happy with that. Let's miss this fool. 
go straight to you. I'm Brock. I'm Puna Jim's leader. I believe in rock hard defense and determination. That's why my Pokemon are all the rock type. You still want to challenge me? Fine then. Show me your moves. Yes. Why is Brock not wearing a shirt? Well. <laughs> Impressive. Taste my bubble. Ooh. Ooh. Aren't you do no? What are you doing? <laughs> you maniac. Get out of here. Get out of here. I know for XP sake it's best to switch one out, but I can't be bothered. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Big chocolate. I took you for granted. I took you for granite. <laughs> As proof of your victory, here's the bold badge. Hmm. That's an official Pokemon lead badge. It's Bearer's Pokemon become more powerful. The technique Flash can now be used anytime. That's a lot of money. Wait, take this with you. Chongus received TM-34. A TM contains a technique that can be taught to Pokemon. A TM is good only once. So when you use one to teach a new technique, pick the Pokemon carefully. TM-34 contains Bide. Your Pokemon will absorb damage in battle and pay it back double. A completely useless attack that I will not be using. There are all kinds of trainers in the world. You appear to be very gifted as a Pokemon trainer. Go to the gym in Cerulean and test your abilities. Um, was I even touched? Was my body not even touched? Bro, did you not even touch my nipples? Bro. You're pretty hot, but not as hot as Brock. Catch you later. 